Netstat is a command line utility used for displaying network connections, routing tables, interface statistics, masquerade connections, and multicast memberships. Here are 8 CMD commands for retrieving specific information about network connections on Windows system. Type CMD in the search bar and run command prompt as an administrator. Netstat A shows all connections and listening ports, including those that are not established. By revealing all active connections, including those that are not yet established, it helps in detecting any suspicious or unauthorized network activity that could indicate a security breach or malware infection. Netstat B displays the executable involved in creating each connection or listening port, requires administrative privileges. When troubleshooting network-related problems, identifying the processes involved can provide valuable insights into the root cause of the issue. Whether it's a misconfigured application, a malfunctioning service, or a network conflict, knowing which processes are involved helps streamline the troubleshooting process and enables quicker resolution of issues. Netstat E. Provides Ethernet statistics, including bytes and packets sent and received. Abnormal spikes or fluctuations in network traffic can be indicative of security threats such as denial of service, DOS, attacks or unauthorized data exfiltration. Netstat E enables administrators to detect and respond to suspicious network activity by alerting them to unusual patterns in Ethernet statistics. This enhances the organization's ability to mitigate security risks and protect sensitive data from unauthorized access. Netstat N shows numerical addresses and port numbers instead of resolving them to host names. Displaying numerical addresses instead of host names helps protect privacy and security by preventing the inadvertent disclosure of sensitive information. In some cases, host names may reveal organizational or geographical information that could be exploited by attackers for reconnaissance or targeted attacks. Netstat N mitigates this risk by obfuscating host names and limiting the exposure of potentially sensitive data. Netstat O displays the owning process ID associated with each connection. Helpful for troubleshooting. The ability to correlate network connections with process IDs is valuable for security analysis. Netstat O allows administrators to detect potentially malicious or unauthorized network activity by identifying suspicious processes or connections. By monitoring process IDs, administrators can quickly identify and respond to security threats, such as malware infections or unauthorized access attempts, before they escalate into more significant security incidents. Netstat R displays the routing table, including the list of network destinations and the gateways to use. The routing table shown by Netstat R includes information about network destinations, subnet masks, gateway addresses, interface metrics, and flags. This information is invaluable for understanding the network topology and ensuring that network traffic is directed to the correct destinations. Netstat S shows per protocol statistics, including IP, ICMP, TCP, and UDP. Netstat S provides detailed metrics for each network protocol, including IP, Internet Protocol, ICMP, Internet Control Message Protocol, TCP, Transmission Control Protocol, and UDP, User Datagram Protocol. This allows administrators to assess the health and efficiency of individual protocols, identify anomalies or abnormalities, and take appropriate actions to address any issues. Netstat T displays all TCP connections and their state, established, listening, etc. Netstat T also displays TCP ports that are in a listening state, indicating that the system is actively listening for incoming connections on those ports. This information is useful for identifying services or applications that are configured to accept incoming connections, as well as for detecting potential security vulnerabilities or misconfigurations that may expose the system to unauthorized access.